Till now we have covered the basics of uh, tabular model and in this video we will learn about how we can implement ducks related stuff in, in tabular. So for this uh, let's go to the grid view. So for example here we have the fact internet sale and uh, here you can see we have sale amount, tax amount, and freight. And uh, we need the actual sale. So we can just write one calculated column. For example, sale amount uh, minus tax amount minus total product cost plus freight. Right? So you can write like actual sale actual sale the name of the column and the colon is equal to this one uh, let me zoom it and then we can write um, sales amount minus total product cost and uh, minus tax amount and plus freight this one hit enter so here you can see this is the actual sale right and uh, now I, I i need to create one measure you just need to click here because uh, this is the table area and here we have to click to to write uh, you you can click anywhere right so we can click here and again you can uh, name for example total sale total sales colon is equal to and sum sales amount uh, actual sale so here you can see one measure is created under measure folder total sales that we have created and we need to deploy and go to the power bi so here we have to so here you can see under fact internet sale we don't have any measure total sale like if i search total sale so there is no total, total sale available we need to refresh because uh, this power bi is already connected with the tabular model and uh, if you go below so here you can see we are getting one total sale so i have i had already dragged the product category i need to click total sale so here you can see we are getting the total sale per category so let's uh, go to the visual studio so here you can see this uh, we need to go to the measure properties we need to select total sales and here you can see we have uh, um, like uh, the the format right now the the format is is I mean is uh, just a um, decimal and uh, we don't have a currency symbol here so here we need to change the general to currency this one and uh, you, for the measure name you you can rename from here or from the uh, total sale uh, this one like if you select it and here you can also change the name there are two places and uh, then there is a display folder here 
so we can write here like uh, um, sales measure measures like this and here you can increase the decimal places so these are the properties of measure so now we need to click this solution explorer tabular tutorial and deploy go to the power bi home and refresh so here you can see it will the the symbol will be changed to currency so see the symbol is has been changed to currencies and uh, here you can see the display folder is available in the um, factory internet sales table so if you expand it you will see one measure total sale if you click total sale see you are not able to see the formula bar here so whenever you need to work with the tabular model all the measures you have to define in the model if you want to create a new measure other than total sale that may measure you can define but if you need to change or enhance this uh, total sale measure that you had already created in the tabular model for this you have to go to the tabular model and again uh, enhance this, that uh, measure uh, otherwise if you want to create another measure this is possible you just need to click new measure and uh, total sales to is equal to sales um, sum actual sale this one so this measure is created right and because this measure is created here so we can change the data type to currency uh, we need to change the format this one so here you can see we are getting the same uh, results here right so for this course i will not uh, cover the complete duck series because i had already created a lot of videos on ducks that you can see under our learn ducks channel so here you can see there are 55 videos available so you can learn about ducks the data type calculator column measures and lot of other functions so all the ducks related concept you can learn from these videos right so and in the same way you can learn um, like uh, power bi ducks with sql if you are coming from the sql background and uh, if you need to uh, work with the power query m language then you can follow this playlist right basic concepts for the ducks language is same if you work with power bi or you work with the um, excel or you work with the our uh, tabular model the basic concepts are same that you can learn from these videos so if you like this video please subscribe our channel and uh, if you have any questions please write it in the comment section thank you